come and celebrate with me. Whoop, whoop. Okay, maybe not in this house, but in the planet. I just had a session with a client. They had a dependence on alcohol to help them feel relaxed. But they knew it wasn't helping them. They weren't able to move forward. So what they had done was linked relaxation to alcohol. So they were using it as a crutch. And the alcohol, there was a payoff. It was feeling relaxed while having alcohol. So why would they want to give up? But alcohol, drinking alcohol is used as a coping mechanism, but it's just a symptom. I always go about the symptoms up here. And what I'm able to do is really get underneath and really see what's going on. They were feeling stuck because they couldn't figure out why they couldn't just stop. Why they could just have a few drinks. And why couldn't they just stop having it every night? Now I get that too because nearly two years ago I gave up drinking, binge drinking. So... And then the byproducts from this is incredible. So they wanted clarity. They're going to be able to get clarity. But guess what else we also found and discovered? I was at help to, able to help facilitate this person. They realised they were able to find relaxation in walking. And in just 20 minutes... They were able to feel the anxiety lift and that's from walking. So now they can, we're able to disconnect that link from alcohol to feel rel relaxed and create a new link to walking because not only do they going to feel better, they're going to feel healthier and they're, so they're making better choices and they're feeling better within themselves, which means they can, well, breathe more was one of the things that they were saying. They wanted to be able to have time to themselves. So they were using, it almost got as two, they were using the alcohol to create a bubble so they weren't constantly bombarded. But what they fa then found is once we disconnected that link to alcohol to have that bubble to feel relaxed, we were able to create a new link to walking to feel relaxed and to have time for themselves. And they can just get up and go. And then even if the weather's bad, what do you do? You just put on a raincoat. You see how different things in the rain when walking. And you can see rainbows. <laughs> anyway, so I just want to um, get you to help celebrate with me. Whoop, whoop. And this was in an hour session with me. So if you'd like to know more and you'd like to wonder, problem is there that really is just the symptom let me know because if we can have a chat and go deep dive underneath and really disconnect from the reaction of either that past experiences or ex experiences people trauma because if it can be linked to a lot of bad trauma but you've pushed it down suppressed it because we don't know how to deal with the feelings that are coming up so you use alcohol to numb all those feelings because you're just i'm so unsure or confused and don't know how to deal with these ang ang anger or frustration sadness because you can and then you can get triggered especially when you've been drinking you don't tend not to have like a filter and you're not able to make correct, right, good decisions when you've been drinking. They're all hazy. And you know, 
hear those beer goggles go on. So it makes a difference if you can really get to the root cause, the underlying thing that's going on. You could, you could have been walking around with this for years. Another client that I had had 50 years worth of panic attacks and anxiety and thought that their blood pressure and going to the doctors was creating all of this, which it was. But it, in actual fact, it wasn't the real problem. It was just the symptom. It was just going and finding out what was going on, helping facilitate how, because you've got the resources within you. You've got all the answers within you. It's just when we get all tied up in knots, we go round and round with worry, stress, anxiety, fear, and we can't move. We can't move through life being happy and making healthier choices. And this person, my last client that I just had, not only did they release the connection to alcohol and relaxation, and there's byproducts from that as well. So they're also shifting more weight because they're going to be making healthier choices. And then because they're not drinking as much, they're also gonna be saving lots of money. Okay, so that's all from me now. Whoop, whoop, celebrate. Dry July, still here, still happening. So if you wanna know more, let's connect. Would love to have a chat and go from there. Bye for now.